నమస్కారం మై డియర్ ఫ్రెండ్స్ ఐఎమ్ శ్రీనివాస్ అయ్య గారి ఇన్ ఫ్రంట్ ఆఫ్ యూ వన్స్ అగైన్ టుడే పీపుల్ సే ఇట్స్ ఏ మదర్స్ డే ఐ డోంట్ నో వై దేర్ షుడ్ బి ఏ సెపరేట్ డే ఇయర్ మార్క్ టు రిమెంబర్ ఏ పర్సన్ హూ ఈజ్ రెస్పాన్సిబుల్ ఫర్ అవర్ బీయింగ్ హియర్ ఇన్ దిస్ వర్ల్డ్ మై వెరీ ఎగ్జిస్టెన్స్ ఈజ్ బికాస్ ఆఫ్ హెర్ మై వెరీ బర్త్ ఆన్ దిస్ ల్యాండ్ ఇట్స్ ఎల్ఫ్ ఈజ్ బికాస్ ఆఫ్ హెర్ so as long as i breathe as long as i live she should be residing in our heart that is what i feel how i think about a mother when i was a child maybe around in my 7th class or 8th class i used to read very good uh, quotations in published in various weeklies you know one quotation which attracted me then it is still in my mind God says he cannot be present, omnipresent everywhere. So he has sent mothers in here to represent him here. So I can even say better, mothers are the place the mothers occupy. I need to give a better place, a higher position than God. Even he will also agree for that. But of late, it is really disheartening, my friend, wherever I go. people old people are able to even walk you know they will be sitting on the pavements the old age homes and all thinking that their children will come one day talk to them not feel them you see they want only to talk to them to say how are you amma even that is also not happening the moral values the graph is falling gradually i feel the mothers in the western world are getting a better respect in the society because the society as a whole there they respect the position of a mother a father an elderly person where everybody gives a pre- preference for senior citizens and all they respect that age even that is missing here we are seeing many cases where mothers have been admitted to this old age homes okay even that also one who can agree because he is busy somewhere he wants to be ahead of others in the race to earn the dollars and yens but that doesn't mean that you can forget a person who has given you your birth here who has made you to be like what you are today the other day i had been to hyderabad i was staying in a lodge near sikandarabad paradise area one uh, in that uh, restaurant one family was celebrating the birthday party of their kid lot of pomp and gaiety because the kid already slept there and the party for the elders began you know what are all the paraphernalia when elders are partying liquor was fully flowing drums were at the highest echo with the food being brought from five star hotels it is wasted mercilessly food is being wasted mercilessly okay it is their own personal affair i came down it was nearly around 9:30 and the footpath i have seen a creature moving that creature can't even open their they have mouth you know it's such a fragile a bony creature her age must be around 80 years she wants she wants a glass of water in one way people are enjoying on the other hand people are dying for a want of a glass of water i went to her i went to a nearby bakery brought a bread and a full cold water bottle sat beside her and asked her she said yes langa she was able to work in the house and earn some income in the house she was kept in the house 
now she has been driven away even now also the children will come fully drunk and take away whatever she gets by begging i have seen a rickshaw puller same similar incidents immediately i went a bit further his age is around 70 to 75 years <coughs> excuse me the hair is fully white the body is sagging you know it was perfectly sweating like the hell as if the rain has drenched him gasping for breath holding a rickshaw which he uses to uh, transport the goods you know in the hyderabad you use rickshaws to transport from shop to house and so he is a rickshaw puller he is not having any stamina the summer was at the peak you know I could not look at his face you know such an unfortunate fellow called him gave him some something he folded his hands i said are bhaiya you are so aged like my own father don't i folded my hand he has a respect for his age and for his sincerity in still trying to do a job in his livelihood we are seeing so many people now so many people the society in one of the places one person was telling two ladies were conversing then one lady hey what happened you are going early the other lady was responding in my house bogi has come no railway bogi has come then she was asking what is a railway bogi she says railway bogi is her mother in law so it is a big botheration and a responsibility so parents are being treated in such a in human way see i get my peace of mind when i talk to go to a old age home talk to them introduce myself as so and so i pretend that i am like your own son then they started telling all their past history how they were how they are what they are missing my dear friends i am telling you they are not missing the money they can beg on the road and they can get their food they are missing a affectionate hi from the doctors and their son that means their children even to say hi do you think that it will cost even that also our people who are running nowhere knowing nowhere what what for they are running why they are running along with everybody they are running and forgetting the very souls who have given them their part i sincerely request whenever i see any person i keep a, a, a box full of biscuits I'm not boasting my dear friend can it's an idea i am implementing actually i never think great about myself i feel god has given me an opportunity to be with the people who suffer i get a lot of happiness if i can make them smile by giving a glass of water to somebody it won't cost me anything at all but i am able to look after the needs of his thirsty mouth so i keep a box full of biscuits you know that to normal bikis and whenever i see these old people particularly old people not commercial beggars i stop to them give him a a glass of water then i put give him some rusk some cakes or something it will hardly cost me 10 rupees each and every one of us can do and make others happy a small deed of quenching his thirst glass of water keep one box full of uh, uh, your uh, mineral water with you you can give one one bottle to each each bottle cost already 10 rupees so on this occasion of the so called mothers day i request each one of you my dear friends our tradition is respecting loving and taking care of the elders and incapacitated that to love matru devo bhava first comes matru devo bhava the first word when i come into the world is amma maybe the last word also may be may end with saying amma in between let us try to entwin the bond of human touch and emotion and be with our beloved mothers god bless you take care shrinivas